So I went out and bought some Jealous Devil Max Roquettes from Walmart. Uh, had them shipped in, got two bags. Um, competition's coming up this weekend and we want to most definitely test and run and see how well and efficient these will do for us. If they don't, we're going to run with the B&B Competition Charcoal. But I'm a Jealous Devil fan. I haven't had a lot of issues with them. So I want to give them a shot and see how they work. So we're going to start by getting the bag open, getting the fire basket loaded up on Unicron, getting them started. Once it comes up to temp, we're going to drop a log in it, hit all our switches for comp mode, Get our ribs seasoned up. We're going to start the party. Let's go. All right, the pits come up to temp. Everything's been shut off. We got our ribs in. It's about 268 right now. Just got this guy show. It's rolling 260 right now. I'm gonna let you guys see what's going on on the inside. Got nice smoke, good sweat back ribs, and we're rolling. We're gonna let her cruise. We're gonna monitor both the digital and the analog gauge. Make sure they stay within the right zone we want to be, and make sure that fan kicks back on at the right time. And we're gonna smoke these out the competition way. So stay tuned for the results. All right, cook's been going on pretty good. We're gonna open up, take a look, and see how we're looking on the basket. So far, so good. Pull them out, get even more visual. As you can see from the basket how we had it loaded up. Good burn on these briquettes. We can add another stick of hickory. Still gonna go pretty good. Um, just fuel, this is the only fuel we're running right now. No propane, just heat and gas. So we're gonna add another stick, keep the party going, probably add a few more briquettes just to make sure we don't run out. We're gonna get it run all day. Test for comp, let's go. A few moments later. All right, about three hours in, we've pulled the ribs. We're gonna go ahead and get them wrapped. We've got our foil already staged here. We're gonna lay down a bit of brown sugar, some seasoning, a little bit of extra magic. We're gonna start phase two of the process in our competition ribs test. We're running the old hickory and comp, road, comp mode on Jealous Devil briquettes. Jealous Devil Max to be exact. So stay with us and watch the full results. All right, all of our ribs are wrapped. We're gonna go ahead, get them back on the smoker, get them run down another two hours, and then we're gonna open them up, let them vent, sauce them, get them finished, all on comp mode on the old Hickory CTORR. Let's go. Moments later. Well, you guys can see how everything came out as a finished product. We haven't sliced yet, but they're gonna. We are going to once they cool down. We have two slabs that we sauced and took out of the boats, and we have other two that we sauced pretty heavily and left in the boats to go back on the heat for about 15 to 20 minutes. Um, all around, looks good on both. I'm a bigger fan. I'm a much bigger fan of these that have the sauce in the boats. Uh, we ran low on sauce on these two. That's why we decided to leave them out. But these two came out looking really good. Uh, we most definitely want to change our strokes so we don't have any run marks there aren't any visible ones on here but we want to make sure we have sauce consistency while a good thick sauce consistency while laying down our bed of sauce as you can see we got some brush marks here that we didn't want uh, this is why i do the practice this is the last practice i'm going to do before swinging bridge uh, as always thank you guys for tuning in and always remember you too can do amazing barbecue the right way see you next time